hello everyone in this video let's see how to create a data source of s3 bucket in aws glow this is my aws management console let me navigate to s3 bucket ETL AWS I have these files in the bucket let's import all these CSV files into AWS Glow in Glow files are also referred as tables Let me navigate to AWS Glow. These are Oracle RDS data source which I have imported already. And I have provided the link below to demonstrate how to import Oracle RDS data source. Let's add a database and name it as S3. Database is created. We have to add classifier. Let's name it as CSV and select csv since the files in the bucket are in csv format delimiter is comma we can specify the required delimiters characters are enclosed with double quotes in the file so i am selecting double quotes we can select required special character enclosed with files are having headers we can also specify custom headers if required. All of files with single column can be checked if the file has only one column. We can trim the columns to remove the white spaces while consuming the file from S3 bucket. Now we have to create crawlers. Crawler name, let's say S3 data source. New data source, data store is S3. Connection is empty since it's S3 bucket. Specify the path of S3 bucket from where to import the files. We can also exclude the files by providing the pattern of the files to be excluded. We should have IIM role to integrate S3 and AWS Glow. We can create the role or update the policy in the existing IIM role. We can also select existing IIM role. I have already created a role, ETL. Frequency, 
I am selecting run on demand. Database is S3 which we created initially. If required we can add prefix to the objects imported from S3 bucket. We can set up grouping behavior and configuration options if required. These are the properties. Crawler is created. Let's run the crawler to import the files from S3 bucket. Crawler for S3 data sources started. Fifty one seconds elapsed. Crawler is getting stopped. Crawler execution is completed. Status is ready. It took fifty seven seconds to complete. Eight tables are imported. Since they are CSV files, suffix is CSV. Thank you guys. Please subscribe the channel and comment in case of any queries.